Bonjour everybody, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new. My name is Louisa, you are watching Lulu C'est la vie. And for today's video, I am going to share with you my favorite styling hair product for fine wavy to curly hair. Those are the products that I use on a day two, three, or four because yes, my brush just fell on the floor and it was a perfect timing. <laughs> yes, your girl is able to keep her hair up to a day four without having to rewash or co-wash or anything like that. My hair is not weighted down. It is a big achievement for me, so I just want to take a second to recognize that because you know when you achieve something, you have to you have to give it a little bit of positive energy, you know? It's important. How is this going to happen? I am going to restyle my hair because this needs restyling. Um this is a day 3, I think, and I work out this morning and this is what I'm working with. Okay, so I'm going to have to detangle my hair and then I will reshape my curls, re style my hair using my favorite product of the moment and I will also show you options before I get into the meat of this video you know where I'm going if you see yourself coming back for more of my video please consider subscribing I will gladly appreciate it if you are enjoying the content of this video feel free to give me a big thumbs up and leave a nice little comment down below also feel free to share this video with a friend in need um, of advice for the curly hair or on your social media. All these steps cost you close to nothing, maybe 30 seconds of your time, which I gladly appreciate. Um, but it helps me out. <clears throat> but it helps me out a lot. So thank you so much for that. Also, don't forget that I'm selling my own merch. Uh, link is in the bio. We're talking microfiber towels, uh, detangling brush, and diffuser. So if you are looking to uh, buy the right product to style your hair and to help you in your day-to-day -day routine, go and check them out. Those are my favorite. I use them every day. So, voila. All right, let's get into this video. Okay, my battery is low. I have a feeling that as soon as I'm gonna start this, the camera's gonna turn off. Let's not put that out there. It, we'll just go with the flow, okay? All right, so the first thing that I'm going to do is uh, Rewet my hair, Rewet my hair ever, ever so lightly um, so that I can detangle my hair. Um, I like to use a mist bottle and thank you so much for my ladies who helped me out in my last curly hair video. I couldn't find the name of this thing. It is a mist, misting, mist spray bottle, something like that. <laughs> All right, so I'm wetting all this and then I'm gonna gently, gently detangle my hair using my favorite detangling brush, which is available in my merch. And we're going gentle, fine, wavy to curly hair, girls. We are treating our hair like it's silk, okay? Um, for the newcomers here, I consider my hair being high porosity, which means that I have a hard time retaining the moisture in my hair. My hair lets go of the moisture very easily and I tend to get poofy hair as the day goes by, more freeze, losing the curl definition. It's a nightmare. So in the products that I'm gonna show you today, uh, those are products that's gonna, that are going to give me a little bit of moisture because my hair is going to need it without weighting my hair down too much. Okay. All right, my loves, I am done detangling my hair. Uh, my hair is damp at the roots, not soaking wet, like parts of my roots are still dry. And as I go lower down my the length of my hair, it's getting wetter, it's feeling a little bit wetter. But it's not dripping water, it's just a little wet. Make sense? Okay, so now that I've detangled my hair and I give it a little bit of moisture, I am ready to apply my styling product. Here's the one that I've been gravitating around in the past few weeks as the weather is getting drier and colder here in the northeast of the US of A. This product is from Not Your Mother's Natural, is the Royal Honey and Kalahari Dessert Live-In Conditioner. Here's what the bottle looks like. This is an affordable, easy to find uh, product. You can find this in your drugstore anywhere. Um, and I like it a lot because it is pretty clean. It has no sulfate, 
no silicone, no paraben, no dyes, no gluten, no phthalates. What this product does to my hair, it gives my hair a good amount of moisture and it makes my hair really soft and I really like that. The way I like to apply this product is, like you just saw, I like to put a few pumps. Oh God, my, hair's, my hands are slippery. A few pumps, like five little pumps. This is what five pumps looks like on my hand. And then I'll take my spray bottle and add a little bit more water. We're talking about a day three right now. My hair has product in it. I can feel it when I put my hands through. So I cannot put too much hydrating products in my hair. So I have to stick with something lightweight, okay? I'm putting two more pumps and I'm just gonna do the back section. All right, now that my hair has the moisture it needs, it's time to style. Um, I will link right here a video uh, for you to see how I like to uh, reshape my curls, uh, refresh my curls on the day two or three because you know, this is not what this video is about, but if you guys wanna know better how I do that, just click right here. Um, my go-to gel, if you've been following me for more than five minutes, you know that my go-to gel is, well, there's two of them, but the one that I use the most because it's the most affordable one and it works the best on my hair is the Bioterra alcohol-free gel. Um, of course, I will link everything down below, you guys. You know how I roll. The other one that I like is the Widad Advanced Climate Control. Uh, I'm not going to use that one today because it's a stronger hold and on the D3, I, like, I don't need that strong of a hold right now. It's not that serious, you know. So today, I'm just going to use my Bioterra gel, you know. So I just noticed my sweat, our sweaty armpits, which... It's pretty much the story of my life, if you follow me a little bit. The people who follow me know the deal with my sweaty armpits. Um, the thing is, I am not gonna change, okay? So we're gonna take, get used to the sweaty armpits and not pretend that I'm not human, um, and then move along with the video. Can we do that? Yes? Thank you. <laughs> All right, so back to the live-in conditioner. Here are the other products that I like to use on my hair on a day two or three. This Gelibration Spray from Jessie Curl works really well if you have, like me, high porosity, fine, wavy to curly hair. If you're looking for something to reshape your curls without weighting your hair down, it gives enough moisture, but not too much, a little bit of hold. So if you're if you have a normal porosity to low porosity hair, uh, this will give you the little bit of hold, the little bit of moisture. It will be just enough for you to restyle your curl. I highly recommend this one. It's very clean. It's made of flaxseed hair gel, which is like the second ingredient in the list. A little bit of glycerin, uh, jojoba oil, aloe vera leaf juice, a little bit of perfume. You know, there's nothing crazy in there and it does a really, really good job. So that's another one that I highly recommend. I love to use this Kinky Curly uh, Spiral Spritz. This is the bottle for those of you who are not familiar. Um, it gives me a little bit of moisture, nothing too crazy, but I have that little moisture, just enough, you know, on those days where you don't need too much moisture. And it gives me the hold. Now the hold is not extremely crazy, but it's a little something, okay? It's also a product that I like to use as a finishing spray, okay? Same thing as the Jessie Curl. Um, once I'm done diffusing my hair, uh, I see that there's a little bit of frizz on the roots. I grab one of those products. Um, if, if I see that my hair is still a little on the drier side, I'll go for the Jessie Curl. If my hair has enough moisture, but just a little bit of frizz that I need to, you know, tamp down, I'll go from, for the kinky curly. All right, let me finish my crown area and then I'll show you the other two products that I have here that I do love, but I am not using them as often as the three other products I just showed you. Well, four with the gel, because of course, I buy a Terra gel, you guys. What, it's, it's everything. All right, we're done with the crown area. 
again, this is a day three. I'm not expecting phenomenal results. I'm happy that I'm gonna have something decent. Okay, before I go and diffuse my hair, I wanna show you the two other products that I like to use, um, but I don't use them as often, but I do like to use them to refresh my hair on a day two, three, or four. Uh, the first one I wanna put in there is the Bioterra Live-In Conditioner, Intense Smoothing Live-In Conditioner. This one is really hydrating. Um, I prefer to use it on a day one, honestly, uh, but it also works on a day two, three, or four if I water it down the same way I watered the Royal Honey and Kalahari. If I water this down a little bit and apply it on the second half of my hair, on a day where my hair is really dry and I know it really, it's thirsty for moisture, it's asking for the moisture, this works really well. All right, the last living conditioner that I like to use is the uh, Curl, Swiss, Curl, Smith, Curl Smith Moisture Memory Reactivator. Um, I started to use this product again after a year and change of not using it. I'll link the video right here for you to see my last review on the Curl Smith hair product. This is a higher end uh, product, so it's more. We're more in the twenty-five ish if not more, um, but they are available at Sally's, they are available on their own website, they actually have a nice little quiz. Um, again, I've been using this product on and off for the past two or so years, and it always gives me a really good end result, it always gives me the right amount of moisture, loving them. All right, so to recap, my top three live-in conditioners, moisturizing live-in conditioners are these three here. I will water them down with a little bit of water. There is no hold uh, in these products and you will get the moisture. So stay away from the roots, concentrate on your length and your tips. And uh, you know, you, you should have a really good result, especially if you have high porosity hair like me, which has a hard time retaining the moisture throughout the day. If your hair on that day is really dry, go for these. I love and adore them. Now, as far as the sprays, this is it for me. Uh, I would say I have a little bit of a preference for JC Curl because it hydrates my hair a little bit and gives me a little bit of hold. Unfortunately, most of the time, the hold is not enough on its own. I have to uh, double it with, um, with my gel, my favorite gel, um, either the Bioterra or the Weedat Advanced Climate Control. Um, the spiral spritz from Kinky Curly, I love it so much. Um, it's okay on the hydration. It could use a little bit of a backup, you know, a little something, something, depending on how your hair is that day. These are in the teens, I think. I have to double check on the price. Um, they're a little bit over $12.00. Um, again, you can find this in most of your drugstores, and this one I usually order it online. Again, everything will be linked in the description box below. All right, my loves, I'm gonna go ahead and diffuse my hair so you can see the end result, and I'm gonna show you how I like to use my finished product. Okay, I'll see you guys in one second. Mm. All right, I'm losing. All right, I'm losing the daylight because you know it's winter time and I'm filming this pretty late in the day. But nonetheless, here is my end result. On a day three, after restyling my hair, as you can see, it's pretty moisture, moisturized, moisture, I don't know. It has moisture, it has definition, it has hold. Um, oh gosh, yeah, I know this background is not gonna work because of the light behind me. Like I'm trying to show you the frizz. I'm not sure if you guys can see it on this camera, but I can see it in my mirror. There is still a little aloe of frizz here, which I don't mind, it's a day three, you guys, like, you know. But this gives me an opportunity to show you how I like to use these two products as a finishing spray. I don't use them both at the same time. I choose which one I want. So which one am I gonna use? Well, since my hair looks pretty moisturized, I don't need any more moisture in my hair. I just need a little bit of hold, right? So I will let the JC Curl aside. 
uh, and use my spiral sprit from Kinky Curly because spiral spritz does not give me a lot of moisture. And I'm just brushing through the top of my hair and on both sides and on the back. But like this time I really concentrate on the roots to the midsection. Don't forget to do the back, of course, you know. Um, and and that's pretty much and that's pretty much it. I'm gonna let that air dry. I'm not going back under the diffuser, and I will let the little bit of product that I put in my hair do a little bit of a cast. Your girl's not a big fan of cast, so I tend to scrunch them out uh, while I'm diffusing my hair because I don't like it like that. Um, but for those of you who love your cast, you probably won't need a finishing product. For those of you who are like me and don't like the cast, this is when the finishing product comes in handy. Now, in a scenario where my hair would come out being a little bit on the drier end after diffusing it, um, I would definitely go for the JC Curl finishing spray because I know that JC Curl is going to give me a little bit of moisture and a little bit of hold which will take care of my frizz on the roots. Voila my love! I'm Alright my loves, I am all said and done with this video. Let me know in the comment section what is your favorite go-to product. Is it, is it any of these or do you have a different one that works for your fine way to curly hair? Please share it with us in the comment section. Um, and then that's it. I will see you guys next week with a new video. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share. And until next week my loves, stay happy, stay healthy, have a beautiful life. Au revoir. Et à bientôt. <rire> hey, c'est la vie. <rire>